All right, here we are at 118 Ellen Street. We're gonna go inside. Have the uh, garage has got two little window cutouts. Looks like somebody did it themselves. Painted pathway up. Little garden kind of set in the front. And Bunch of plants. And painted the brick, painted the patio. Little covered patio here. Not too bad. It's like a newer screen. Not too bad. Go inside. Now the electric is turned off right now and water as well. Um, someone painted the floor and put a bunch of peel and stick tiles down over the original hardwoods. Uh, all that is raised up and is uh, peel and stick. Not done very well either. Um, behind the door here we have a little coat closet. Front window, little dated windows, single pane. Got the pass through into the kitchen from the living room. Somebody tried to make it look all piratey. We got the laminate floor in the kitchen. Dated cabinets. Missing the refrigerator. Uh, the countertop was uh, recovered with a single sheet of laminate on top, just glued there. The white appliance stove. And it is vented. Dated window above the sink here. A little bit of crown molding up there with the uh, tiki theme going on in here, very beachy. Got the wood walls, ceiling fan, just needs cleaned up a little bit, it looks like. Double doors sliding to the back. Big backyard, all fenced in. The opening to the garage here. Single car garage. Uh, does not have an automatic opener, only manual. Water heater here has been uh, winterized, and we got a washer and dryer hookup right here in the garage. Backyard here is nice and big, fenced in all the way around. This is definitely a good part of the house. We have the uh, newer HVAC unit. It's good condition, pretty new, actually. I mean, maybe only a year or two. Uh, some some weird notice here is uh, we got all these little granite pieces scattered throughout the yard. Old countertops broken up and all over the place. You see them all around the tree there. Um, but the yard's a big size, already fenced in. Feels pretty private. It's nice. Got the fence all the way around. One single sheet of laminate floor here. Um, let's go see the bedrooms. Right here we have a Little pantry closet across from the kitchen. Little details everywhere. It's one bedroom. It's probably about 10 feet by 11 or 12. Uh, missing the closet doors. Painted wood floor. Um, you can see though that it could be all scratched off and refinished. Um, so that's a good thing. Got the uh, doorbell update. Uh, we got the full bathroom right here. It's hard to see. I know the lights are out. It's tile all the way around the walls, half up. Um, dated fixture. Uh, maybe an updated sink. It's all been winterized. 
Um, hard to see with the lights out on the video, but um, nonetheless, we got a full bathroom there. At the end of the hallway, we go left. We have another uh, bat, uh, bedroom, probably a square, 12 foot by 12 foot. Um, two windows in here, both dated. Closet doors, dated ceiling fan. It's again, painted floor, but uh, looks like it could be sanded off and refinished. Looks like they just put, yep, they just put a latex paint right over the floor. It'll sand right off and refinish. And the final bedroom, we have a dated ceiling fan again, um, painted everywhere. The half bath on here. Interesting tile floor, um, little pedestal sink. You know, not much, but it is another bathroom, which is nice. Looks like the HVAC runs through the ceiling. Um, two windows in this room. Once again, the painted floor could definitely be cleaned up. Um, and that concludes our tour. Do another walk through here and explain the layout. So you walk right in. And the first room you come into here is the uh, family room, our living room. It's probably about 12 foot by 14 foot. Um, you got the pass through into the kitchen. Kind of gives it a nice open feel. Got this uh, bar here. Um, dining, eat-in dining kitchen there, dated cabinets, and the garage is right there, washer and dryer hookups out there. As so you come down the hallway, you got one bedroom on the left, then you have your bathroom on the right, the dark room right there, then you got another master bedroom on the right, and the last bedroom on the left over here at the end of the hallway. Pretty good looking house overall, just needs a good cleaning. Neighborhood seems decent. That's all.